We all know Virginia is for lovers, but did you know Virginia rocks? In the University of Richmond's Laura Robbins Gallery of Design from Nature showcases the state's unique geologic history. Virginia's geologic history is very long and very complex, and that understanding that um, complexity is uh, through the rocks. The rest of the exhibit takes guests through the regions of Virginia. There are five provinces, uh, physiographic provinces in Virginia, and um, we have samples uh, from every province. Let's take a tour. The coastal plain began forming 65 million years ago, around the time scientists believed dinosaurs went extinct. This sedimentary specimen came from Surrey County. It is the state fossil of Virginia. Fossils form when all organic material is replaced by rock. In this cluster, you can see the sediment that has cemented and compacted the fossils together, forming the rock. Virginia's neighbor was once the African continent. When the two land masses moved toward each other, they created a patchwork of pushed together rocks that are now part of our state. Guess where this igneous rock came from? Goochland, and formed when magma below the Earth's crust cooled slowly. Because this rock forms beneath the surface, we have to dig in a quarry to find it. Once as tall as the Himalayas, the Blue Ridge is an ancient mountain range made up of rocks that can be up to billions of years old. This igneous specimen came from Madison County. It formed when magma below the Earth's crust cooled slowly and younger sedimentary rock on top eroded away. This type of rock is the oldest in the state around one billion years old. Once a shallow tropical ocean, today the topography of the valley and ridge matches the waves of its past. A sedimentary rock, this specimen came from Blacksburg and is nicknamed Hokie Stone. It forms chemically when mineral particles are deposited by a liquid mixture. Though it is famous today because of the architecture of Virginia Tech, this rock is evidence of the area being covered millions of years ago by a shallow ocean. Although we often associate the Appalachian area with mountains and coal mining, this region is really one large, elevated landmass. It has undergone extreme weathering over millions of years, creating the rugged topography we know today. To take your own rock and road trip through the state, check out the article below. This has been a special report from the Science Matters interns.